Good morning, class. Are you fine this morning? I hope you are fine. All right. Today, the first section we focus on grammar galaxy two, right? And today we will review unit unit sixteen. So, what grammar point do we focus in unit sixteen? Everyone, remember? Okay, good job. We focus on information questions. Okay, and in our textbook, there are five information questions that we focus on, right? Okay, here are the five information questions: who's, what, which, how many, and how much. Okay, so now review all the part with me. Okay, so now let's start with number one: who's optional plus noun. It used to show possession. You know possession, everyone. Possession like the owner, right? Okay. So now look at the question here. The example: Whose glasses are these? They are mine. So mine here is the possession, right? It means my glasses. Okay. How about number two? What plus now to show many choices? Okay, when you want to know or when you ask about something, have a lot of choices. So you use a what plus noun, right? Okay, you can look at the example here. What activities do you like to do? I like reading a book and gardening. Or sometimes you can add more question, right? Because it has a lot of choices. I like reading a book, cooking, gardening, and playing volleyball. Example. Okay, so here, when you want to know or when you want to ask about a lot of choices, you use what the pronoun. But when you want to know or want to ask about a small number of choices, you use this one, which. Plus noun, okay. Which plus noun to show a small number of choices, okay? So you can look at the example here. Which pet do you want, dog or cat? A dog. Okay, you see which pet, which, which, and pet is a noun, right? And just only two choices, dog or cat. Usually, when you use which plus noun. We use to show two choices, most questions, and you answer. You choose only one among the two, right? A dog, not a cat. Well, so now we finish the three uh, information questions, and I hope you can understand them very well. Let's continue to number four. Four. How many? Plus count now. You know, count noun, everyone. The count, count noun means the noun that we can count. And in this case, we can say plural noun. Okay, how many plus plural noun to show number? You can look at the example here. How many people are here? How many people are here? Twenty-five. So twenty-five here is the number, right? Okay. Well, so when you use how many plus plural noun, it is when you answer, you need to answer with the number. Make sure you can understand this very well. And in this case, you cannot use it. Use how many to plus singular noun cannot. Okay, only plural noun. Only plural noun. Remember. Okay, number five. How much plus non-count noun? Okay, how much plus noun count noun to show amount, right? Amount of something, right? Okay, example here. How much cheese do you need? Four kilograms. So four kilograms here is the amount, right? That you want to to know. And one more, when you how much without non count noun, so you you to ask about the cost. Okay, cost mean price, right? Example here. How much are these T-shirts? Ten dollars. So ten dollars here is the cost, right? Okay. So can you remember and understand the five information questions on the whiteboard, everyone? Okay. In fact, in our lesson, I add three more points for you, right? Did you remember? 
Okay, I, I, when ask for the time, right? What, where ask for the, the place and why are for the, re, the reason. Okay, so now before we finish our first session, I would like you to read the five information questions with me again. Yeah. One, host plus noun to show possession. Two, what plus noun to show many choices. Three, which plus noun to show a small number of choices. Four, how many plus count, count noun to show number. Five, how much plus non-count noun to show the amount. And how much no non-count noun to show the cost. Okay, so now we finish our first session and see you in the second session.